these new shoes and uh, in the dressing room look somebody decided to uh, spill a whole lot of, well, it might be the baby drank through last night yes. and they've just got oil everywhere so this old lady is slipping around yes i feel like i'm ice skating it's very very tragic are you uh, tonya harvey <laughs> The bad news is we've peaked. It's all downhill after this. So anyway, I decided to go and put my makeup on. Yes. And so badly. <laughs> so one of the baby drags last night, perhaps, I think they did it on purpose. Yes. They actually uh, 
Um, and I don't know what they did to it, but something happened with the uh, the light that I was putting the whole makeup with. So yeah. she actually had beautiful lighting. So she has no excuse. Well, we are working under dry conditions. They are renovating out the back. We were, had to put our makeup on to a green and orange flashing strobe light. Well, I don't know. I just took I'm, just, I'm just looking at your makeup and how it's scrubbed up on stage and, and it's actually okay. Do you know what? I, I, I look like all four golden girls. <laughs> My agents like all four golden girls combined. Rolled into one. And the thing is, we, we you know, we, the time just, you know, we, Miss Ken and I haven't seen each other since we were here last, which was quite a little while ago. And we had a lot of catching up. It's not because I don't like you. <laughs> and we had a lot of catching up, and the time just flew, and we had no time. Of, but we've had a bit of a debate about the wig situation. We really have. Now, we want to, to get the clatter meter happening. Yes. Yeah. These are the same wigs. Yes. Now, Still I, more and better. Now, I saw this on one of the E entertainment. Still more and better. Or new, new weekly always have, you know, the girls in the same dress. Yes. Which we have. And also, which wig, who wore it better? Yes. I've opted for a, what I call a 60s kind of look. Right. Where uh, the lovely Barbara's opted for up just being fuck stupid look. <laughs> And I said, because I said to Candy, your wig's a bit flat, and she a bit, bit low. And she said, what do you mean, low? I said, not high. <laughs> You've got to break it down for her. And then, but not only is it not high, it's what it's what the fashion police would call asymmetrical. It's what I call lopsided. And your yeah. hair is lopsided. Now let's talk shoes. But, but can we? But we're going to open it up to the. Who preferred? We're going to throw it open to the audience because. Okay, why don't you lucky men? We're going to take either of us home. Yeah. Firstly, which hairdo would you okay. like to be sitting on your face? Yeah. First, Vote once, vote loudly. But first, whoever loses has to wear their hairstyle next gig, which I think is in December. Okay. But, but who prefers Miss Candy's hair? Oh, right. What a resounding endorsement. Who prefers my hair? Who the fuck did not vote? <laughs> Anyway, it doesn't matter. Anyway, but look, it's okay. Miss Kenny said, she, I said to her tonight, I said, it's a bit low. She, you know, it's not high. She goes, I prefer it like this. She said, I don't like your hairstyle. <laughs> anyway. And I, I said, we've been working together for 30 years and now you tell me? Anyway. Alright. Okay. <laughs> What we have, we always love to have our little special guest star. Well, oh, no, Miss Candy, we've got to find me a boyfriend first. Oh, absolutely. Come we on now, Margaret needs a boyfriend. I was watching the Science Channel this week. And, and she wonders why she doesn't have a boyfriend. <laughs> I was watching the Science Channel on Foxtel, and I was in tears. I was howling like an absolute orphan Annie, like a heartbreaking child. This science documentary was absolutely heartbreaking and devastating. Because in that science documentary, I found that Stephen Hawking is married. And I'm not. I want you to think about that. You're okay. not somebody. I've, not only have I got Unlike Stephen Hawking, lovely long legs. <laughs> have you seen the legs lately? I have, 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 have lovely long legs. I'm going to bet London to a brick I've, I've got a bigger dick than Stephen Hawking, okay? And the so I can. just want the gays to lift their game. <laughs> Good luck.
Uh, now look, I've got to talk about your legs. While we are talking about her legs, I think this is oh, can, can we not talk about the shoes? I'm not going to talk about the shoes. <laughs> there are, that's what it needs to be said. <laughs> They're just shocking. Do you love the shoes? Yes. Yes. Says Miss Candy, who's wearing shoes that make her feet look like they're having an epileptic fit. <laughs> these shoes, I mean, these shoes make her feet look. <laughs> I try getting a shoes in a size 46 B. For God's sake! <laughs> these shoes started their life as a long boot. <laughs> these shoes have a Facebook page. <laughs> these shoes. <laughs> Have a history longer than some drag performance. <laughs> All right, and I know my shoes. But Stephen Hawking can't walk. <laughs> He's got shocking dental hygiene. <laughs> He's not very attractive. <laughs> oh my God! Why you... the fuck am I single? Please tell me. Because you're not a very nice person. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now look. Can you, Wait, know? you know what? I, I walk my little bees on freeze through the park and I always say hello. Hello, hello. I'm very friendly. And you're too talkative.